Hey guys, Geeky41 here, and today we're going to look at the Amazing Spider-Man 2 Marvel Legends Infinite Series, The Amazing Spider-Man 2 Spider-Man, Build a Figure Collection Ultimate Green Goblin. Oh, it's a mouthful. Um, here is the packaging. Uh, yes, I know this came out about three or four months ago in January. It came out in January, and uh, why would I be reviewing now? Because... Well, to celebrate the release of The Amazing Spider-Man 2, which, by the way, The Amazing Spider-Man 2 is a great Spider-Man movie, a great Spidey action film, I highly recommend you see it. Um, I am late on reviewing this, I reviewed this yesterday, the file got deleted, and I had to uh, re-film this again, so I'm re-filming it now. Uh, I saw The Amazing Spider-Man 2 on Friday, and uh, a great movie, definitely highly recommend you watch it. Um, uh, it's, a, it's a great review. It's a great movie. Uh, here is the packaging. Got the Amazing Spider-Man 2 logo there. And on the top, you got build a fair collection Green Goblin. And got a logo of us. Uh, got the Amazing Spider-Man uh, movie logo. Spider-Man logo. On the side, you got uh, Spider-Man just swinging. On the side, you got him swinging again. And you can see my reflection. Hi. Uh, and you can see Marvel Legends Infinite Series, Amazing Spider-Man, Hasbro. And then you got warning in here on top. Warning choking. You got choke. Warning choking as your small parts, not for children under three years old. It's four and up. Uh, I am ten years from four, so uh, here are. I am ten years above four, the age of four. Uh, here is the Amazing Spider-Man Two Marvel Legends Infinite Series. Got to read up there. Uh, no matter what evil rises, the Amazing Spider-Man will summon the courage to defeat it. For with great power comes great responsibility. Yep, everyone knows that. Just like everyone knows about the Geico slogan. Alright? Alright? Okay. Uh, got a cool picture of S Spidey right there. Um, and then you got build a figure collection, Green Goblin, each all separately. And then got a uh, Carnage, Toxin, Electro, Made Spider Man, Movie Sp Spider Man. Uh, you got Black Cat and. Uh, no, Black Cat and Spider Woman. Uh, Vulture or Beetle? Uh, I think that's uh, that's Boomerang, and I think it's Vul Vulture. I'm not sure. Uh, Spear Spider-Man, and then they got Toxin and uh, Carnage. Now, I don't think they should have put Spear Spider-Man, or they should have not put uh, these these two characters here because in the movie there's another character named Green Gob Green Goblin, not Ultimate Green Goblin, the Green Goblin. Uh, uh, played by the actor who plays the guy, kid from Chronicle. Everyone knows that. <laughs> uh, but the Green Goblin in the Amazing Spider-Man 2 is an awesome character. A really cool character. And I, I really wish they had him in this line. Um, instead of a built ult Ultimate Green Goblin, they should have been a built a figure Rhino. Huh? Wouldn't that be awesome? From the movie, the mechanized Rhino suit, which a lot of people hate. I liked it. It was pretty cool. Uh, but yeah, I definitely wish there was a Green Goblin. Here from this for the main Spider-Man 2. Uh Marvel Select is making their own Spider-Man uh from this for the main Spider-Man 2, so maybe they might make the Green Goblin 2 as well. So uh just to get a size of just to get a, a glimpse of how tall the package is here. Here he is com here's the package compared to a regular uh Blu-ray movie uh case. Just to get an idea how yes I use this comparison. To get an idea of the size comparison now, uh, so there's been a lot of reviews of this, and I'm just gonna be doing what I, I like to do on my channel is reviews and unboxings at the same time. Let's just get this out. So he comes with this instruction manual here. Uh, how to build the ultimate green goblin. Uh, it's simple, just uh, plug this piece there in there, slot, 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 peg, peg. It's uh, just basic stuff. I mean, just basic. Like, we're that stupid because we, we don't. Like, we're that stupid. Uh, here's Spidey. Let's get Spider Man on the package. Oh, Flame Factor already came out. Let me get back in there. Alright, so, there's the flame effect, uh, nicely molded and painted and stuff. Okay, 
here's the Green Goblin, the Ultimate Green Goblin hand. Uh, Articulation-wise, you can tell that it will rotate 360 degrees. It will go outward. Uh, it rotates at the bicep, double joint elbow, and uh, ball hinge in the hand. And look at those claws. Okay. And uh, this is just a remold of the incredible, not incredible, of the Avengers Hulk, the six-inch Avengers Hulk. They just uh, repainted, resculpted the hands, and sculpted some uh, spikes on the um, shoulder piece there and the forearm. Uh, on to the main attraction, Spider-Man. Uh, get the two hands, two flipping hands. Okay, so here's Spider-Man, uh, looking all awesome. Uh, in terms of size, he is about six inches. Uh, here it's compared to a regular seven inch figure. A uh, shark Eureka there. Very cool, very cool. And here's compared to an Expo marker. Yeah. Uh, very nicely done. Uh, this is probably one of the best Spy Spider Man figures that Hasbro's done. And very, very cool. Very cool. Um, you see all the sculpted edges. Sculpted uh, lines, got some black painted in there, got some shading in the boots. Uh, very cool. Very iconic to the uh, comics, the way Spider-Man looks in this new Amazing Spider-Man movie. Very cool. Uh, this, can all, this can be a classic figure for you too, but just the movie logo is what makes it not a comic. But it, this is a really cool uh, Spider-Man action figure. Um, in terms of articulation, awesome. It's Marvel Legend for crying out loud. Uh, his head can go all the way up. You can just pop it out and just um, slide that downward and peg it there, and he can look even more up. He's like, oh, "Is that heaven?" Uh, and he can look downward like so. He rotates. Uh, he has a uh, shoulder joint there, or he has a pectoral muscle joint there. So he can be like, Hah! he his hands can go all the way up, and they can rotate, 360 degrees. He rotates the bicep, double joint knees, ball hinge in the uh, wrist, uh, in the hand. He has an ab crunch, very nice ab crunch. Rotation is degrees at the waist. His uh, legs go forward, and not much back of his butt. Uh, double joint knees, rotation is degrees at the boot. Uh, his feet go all the way back, about that much, all the way up, and he has a gorgeous angle pivot to get him to great spiral poses. Now, accessory-wise, he does come with the Green Goblin piece, and he does come with the Flame Effect, which you, sh which you can put on his hand there. Okay, I'm not even going to be building the Green Goblin anyway, so... Uh, yeah, not much. Sure. I might just put it on my chart, Walking Dead chart zombie, that piece. Uh, he also comes with two pairs of hands, uh, two flipping hands and two fisting hands, which is on him already. What you do is just simply just pop out the uh, fisting hand and find which one is the left or right one. If you have the IQ of a donkey, then you probably will figure that out. Uh, and then just pop it on, and boom. There is Spidey flipping. And then again with the great amount of articulation, you can get him to some good poses. Awesome. And he's not even leaning on the background. Just awesome. So that's just... So, this is a great Spider-Man action figure. Um, I've had this for since January, and I already opened it. I just repackaged it because it's fun to unbox, and it's all I really wanted to show how it looks in package too, because it's a great packaging as well. Um, yeah, I'm late on this. I think how I did the review. This is not even like a review. It's just a just looking at the action figure. I'm not even doing a review on this because there's been so many reviews and so much information that I'm just going to be rehashing it again and again. So, 
This is a great Spider Man action figure. Definitely giving this a 5 out of 5. Articulation, paint, sculpt, and just what you can do with Spider Man is in this action figure. Except he cannot really flip. There's no web effect. But you can just use a uh, regular clear uh, twisty, twisty tie that they have in the action figures and just apply that there. But yeah, this is a great action figure. Highly recommend it. Um, I highly recommend you go check out the Amazing Spider-Man 2 movie in theaters. It's a great movie. Great Spider-Man movie. Uh, don't listen to the picky critics. It's actually not a bad movie. It's really good. Definitely like a 4, a low 4 out of 5. It's pretty good. Yeah. So yeah, this is the Geek41 signing out. Um, I also bought this guy on Amazon for $16.99. Which is a great deal. It's a great price. Now all I need is to get Electro. And uh, hopefully Marvel Select releases their Green Goblin. So yeah, this is Geek41 signing out. Bye guys.